Hello guys, this is Ari Tutorials, and I apologize for not making much videos lately. That's due to the fact that I'm going to school. Uh, school just started a few days ago, so yeah. Um, here I am with another tutorial. Again, it's in Photoshop. Don't have any time to do it in any other program. Okay, so let's open up Photoshop first of all. And this tutorial was requested by a uh, by my subscriber. So uh, go to File New Dimensions doesn't matter, and uh, you will probably know by the title of the video what it's gonna be about. But anyways, it's about uh, creating shadows to object or bending objects, that sort of thing. So let's create a text first. Uh, a bit laggy. Okay, really laggy. <laughs> That's because I haven't used it for a while. It's cold. It's cold and laggy. Um, anyways, let's just create a text. Shall we? I guess the computer says no, we shall not. <laughs> okay, it says we shall. So, type in whatever you like. D E X D. Huh. Okay. Uh, let's change the color of the text. Okay, you you decide to be laggy computer today. Um anyways, Let's change the color. Color overlay. Um, yeah, let's change it. Let's change it to black because I like black, and you can't say nothing about it. And if you do, you're racist. Just kidding. Uh, let's make this bigger. Hold Shift and size it up. All right. Comrades, uh, now let's duplicate it. Uh, hopefully you know how to duplicate. If you don't, you shouldn't be here. Uh, just kidding. <laughs> uh, okay, now let me see. I haven't done this for a while. Let me see how to do this. I'm actually doing it on the fly. On the fly. Okay, I'll go back and explain, but for now I'm just trying it out for myself. Okay, so what you want to do is uh, select the second text, the one that's duplication of the first one, and you know, the, hold the corner and hold control and just go down. Oops, just make sure that it becomes bigger, and then you can do that. So control and go like this as much as you want to, as much of a shadow that you want to get. Okay. And then ju just drag it under, you know, under where the base of the text is. All right. Now hit enter and uh, here at the opacity. Reduce the opacity a bit to about 45%. Okay, that looks good. And yeah, it's, it would be pretty much it. So it's really basic. I actually just, you know, hold shift, I mean, hold control and drag it around. Sometimes it's much more complicated than that because different objects from different points of view, from different points of light, lighting require completely different types of shadows. And sometimes you can't, you, you, it's impossible to create a shadow for some things. But, uh, anyways, thank you for watching. This will be pretty much it for the tutorial. Uh, this is basically what we get a text with a shadow. Um,
and I've been getting a lot of inactive subs, I just wanted to say that. So I might not do as many videos now, maybe once a week, because not that many people seem to be interested. Um, yeah, that'll be it. Thank you for watching and see you next time.